गाइस दिस इज चेतन फॉर गिज टाइम्स एंड यू वाचिंग अ क्विक हैंड्स ऑन विद द सैमसंग गैलेक्सी एम थर्टी एस दैट्स नाउ ऑफिशियली लॉन्च इन इंडिया दिस फोन इज एन अपग्रेड फ्रॉम द एम थर्टी विद क्वाइट अ फ्यू मेजर अपग्रेड्स विच आर इंपॉर्टेंट टू द यूजर्स मेजरली विद द प्रोसेसर विद द कैमरा एज वेल एज विद द बैटरी लाइफ सो दोज आर दो थ्री एरियाज विच आर कंसिडर्ड एज द मेजर पेन पॉइंट फॉर यूजर्स इफ दे आर ट्राइंग टू चेंज टू अ न्यू फोन इफ यू आर ट्राइंग टू अपग्रेड द डिवाइस Uh, that's where the processor or the performance matters the battery life and then the camera or the imaging setup matters so here are the major differences between the M30 and now the M30s uh, the price of this phone is in the description below we uh, and uh, let's start with uh, what are the major differences so the first difference is uh, the Exynos chipset being upgraded here it was Exynos 7904 on the Galaxy M30 now it's exynos 9611 which is quite a big change the 9000 9, series actually was seen in the galaxy a50 and the likes of those phones and now in the m series you are seeing the same in the m30s so uh, this brings in not just the change in the performance because the uh, one ui is still the same so obviously the performance would change in the day to day usage in the interface but this brings in some good changes in the gaming experience in pubg mobile now you are going to get the graphics settings for up to hdr and ultra and the combination of even smooth plus extreme frame per uh, frame rate that's 60 fps you are getting under smooth gameplay so that is one major upgrade from the galaxy m30 next with the cameras uh, this a change in all the three sensors here earlier there was a 13 megapixel camera uh, the primary one now it's a 48 megapixel samsung sensor which brings in pixel binning to uh, come out with 12 megapixels good captures and that is a primary sensor here second one earlier was a 5 megapixel wide angle camera now it's an 8 megapixel wide angle camera and the third one now is a 5 megapixel depth sensor so it's a triple lens camera combination on the back and it has a uh, kind of a unique design there uh, for the entire camera module there uh it's a vertical uh, setup with the flash on the side and also the branding for the 48 megapixels so that sensor is being given that importance here third one is the battery change 5000 mAh battery already was a good battery life on the M30 and the M series was always known for good battery lives now it's a 6000 mAh and probably one of those phones to have one of the only phones actually in the market to have 6000 mAh battery there was one phone from jioni that had a 6020 mah battery with two batteries of 30 uh, 3010 uh, capacities now this is a single 6000 mah battery the phone doesn't seem heavy at all it's still under 200 grams and that also is thanks to the fact that the phone uh, ha- does not have any heavy glass or metal backplate it's still plastic back but having a 6000 mah battery and under 200 grams it's going to be quite comfortable to hold and use because uh, larger batteries usually increase the weight of the phone but that's not the case here and that's a good thing so these are the three major upgrades now coming back to the phone and the major specs of this device uh, what's not changed is the super amoled display it still has the super amoled display with the 6.4 inch uh, screen size 
and uh, this the full HD plus resolution with the 1018 to 2340 pixels. Next, uh, there are variants with the 4GB RAM, uh, 64GB storage, 6GB RAM, 128GB storage. The one that we are showing you here is uh, the 6GB RAM, 128GB storage option. Uh, the 6000 mAh battery can be charged uh, with the 15 watt charger. That's 15 watt fast charging support offered here. And this USB Type C connectivity here. There's also the earphone jack towards the bottom. There's a microphone and the speaker grill all towards the bottom of the device. The second uh, noise cancellation microphone is present on the top of the phone. There's a dedicated micro SD card slot in case you want to expand the storage uh, uh, from the regular storage that is given here. On the right are the buttons, the power button and the volume rocker buttons. And the phone runs Android 9 Pie based one UI that's 1.5 version. And uh, that's a good thing. You aren't getting the earlier uh, used experience UI that was present on the Galaxy uh, M10, M20 M and M30. Now the Samsung has shifted it to one UI even on the M series, not just to A series. And also the other fact was about the Super AMOLED displays which are present on the A series in the mid-range phones. Now they are on the M series as well. So the M30s also gets the same. And one more good thing with the gaming here is also the part about the uh, game recording here. Uh, most of the phones in the uh, in the market that you see are restricted with the gaming uh, game recording where you don't see the audio getting recorded except for some phones uh, such as phones from Asus from OnePlus where the custom ROMs have been uh, I mean changed up uh, to actually record the in-game audio and that is possible here as well and you get the straight away options under the game booster and uh, that does that doesn't have only the option for the game recording there's also uh, limited notifications there are things that you can change when you're playing games but the important one is about uh, recording the game uh, while also having the audio part in it so audio is not going to be missed out here if you're someone who likes to play games and have that recorded to upload it on uh, social platforms this phone can do that for you so that's it about the galaxy m30s uh, this is going to be priced under 20,000 rupees we aren't sure of the actual price so you'll have to check out the description below for the official price of this phone and uh, it comes with the 6.4 inch display the exynos 9611 6000 mAh battery 48 megapixel primary camera with the triple lens camera combination on the back a 16 megapixel selfie camera on the front for selfies and that's it about this phone i hope you like this video if you do do share and subscribe to Kismo times for more thanks for watching and see you in our next video